Hello world, my name is Dana ID Matthews and welcome to my show about stuff and today I'm going to talk about the new live action Lion King movie teaser trailer. Wow, that's a hard one. Okay, now I'm sure a lot of people have feelings about this. On one hand, you're going to get the people that think this is a blasphemy because of their love and nostalgia for the original legendary cartoon movie. Uh, and I understand those feelings. You know, I kind of feel the same way, uh, you know, because it's, it's a type of movie where, you know, do you need a remake? No, there is nobody that was, you know, out there like, hmm, you know what? I think the original Lion King can be improved upon with live action graphics and animation, you know, but we are, we're, we're kind of living in a time where movies are being remade and reinvented to death. Uh, not a lot of new ideas, so seeing something like this being done, you know, to a worldwide beloved and classic children's film is, you know, almost like a slap in the face to a lot of people's childhoods. Um, but on the other hand, I'm kind of a sucker for live action stuff. Uh, you know, the, the, the trailer is a teaser trailer, so it's only, you know, about a minute and a half, so you don't get to see much. Uh, but, 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 but from what you can see, I, I, you know, I can't just, I can't sit here and, and just, you know, uh, um, you know, shit on it, basically. It seems to me like they're going to try and be faithful to the cartoon version, because uh, some of the scenes are clearly copies of the original. Um, and to be honest, because of the Lion King's iconic status, I feel like they're going to take care of, of the film and do it justice. Um, I, I liked how the characters looked in the live action. You know, as a kid, I always wondered what the Lion King would look like with real animals. And this is as close as you're probably going to get it as, you know, because ma making movies with real animals and that many of them and all that, I'm, I'm sure is 100% unrealistic. Uh, yeah, I, I personally like the way it looks. When you see Rafiki in the trailer, I thought he looked, he looked cool as hell, you know, because it, it, the overall, you know, color and tone of the film is a little darker. Uh, than the, you know, than all the brightness in the cartoon. So all the bright colors in the in in the live action actually kind of pop out, uh, you know, and, and pop off the characters, which I think looks very cool. Uh, you know, I'm not mad. I, I'm not mad at this remake. You know, does the Lion King really need one? Probably not. Uh, but these are the times in the film industry. You know, um, until the remakes stop making money. Uh, people will most likely continue making remakes of old classics and you know so far i i see no proof that the movie won't be good uh, and like i said earlier um i don't think they'll screw it up because i'm sure that both you and i know that if this movie deviates too much from the original or ends up just being plain old not good disney will be hearing a lot of disgruntled people claiming they ruined their childhood and with that said that's it for me my name is Dana I.D. Matthews, and this is my show about stuff. Thank you very much for listening. Peace out.